Defense in Depth is a cybersecurity strategy that employs multiple layers of defense to protect an organization's data and resources. This approach acknowledges that no single security measure is foolproof, and by layering various protective technologies and practices, organizations can create a more resilient security posture. Understanding the principles of defense in depth is essential for developing an effective cybersecurity strategy. At its core, defense in depth involves implementing overlapping security measures to protect against various threats. Each layer serves a specific purpose, creating a comprehensive security framework. Common layers of defense include perimeter security, network security, endpoint security, application security, and data security. Perimeter security serves as the first line of defense against external threats. This layer typically includes firewalls, intrusion detection systems, IDS, and intrusion prevention systems, IPS. Firewalls control incoming and outgoing traffic based on predefined security rules, while IDS and IPS monitor for suspicious activity and block potential attacks. Implementing strong perimeter security measures helps to reduce the likelihood of unauthorized access to the network. Network security encompasses measures taken to protect the integrity and usability of networks and data. This layer involves securing the network infrastructure through segmentation, access controls, and monitoring. Network segmentation divides the network into smaller, isolated segments, limiting lateral movement in case of a breach. Access controls ensure that only authorized users can access sensitive data and resources. Endpoint security focuses on protecting individual devices that connect to the network. This layer includes antivirus software, endpoint detection, and response EDR solutions and device management practices. Organizations must ensure that all endpoints, including laptops, desktops, and mobile devices have up-to-date security software and configurations. Regular patching and updates are essential for preventing vulnerabilities from being exploited. Application security involves protecting software applications from threats throughout their development and deployment. This layer includes practices such as secure coding, vulnerability assessments, and regular testing. Organizations should implement security measures at every stage of the Software Development Lifecycle, SDLC, to minimize the risk of security flaws that attackers could exploit. Data security is critical for safeguarding sensitive information. This layer involves encryption, access controls, and data loss prevention, DLP, solutions. Encrypting data at rest and in transit ensures that it remains unreadable to unauthorized users even if it is intercepted. Implementing strong access controls and monitoring data access helps prevent unauthorized data breaches. The effectiveness of defense in depth relies on the integration and coordination of all layers of security. Organizations should establish clear policies and procedures that outline how each layer interacts and reinforces the others. Regular security assessments and audits can help identify gaps in the defense strategy and ensure all layers function as intended. User education and awareness play a vital role in the success of an in-depth defense strategy. Employees must be trained to recognize potential threats and understand their responsibilities in maintaining security. Creating a culture of security awareness encourages users to take an active role in protecting organizational assets. Defense in depth is a multifaceted approach to cybersecurity that emphasizes the importance of implementing multiple layers of protection. Organizations can create a resilient defense against cyber threats by combining perimeter, network, endpoint, application, and data security. Proactive planning, regular assessments, and user education are essential components of an effective defense in depth strategy, ultimately helping organizations protect their critical data and resources.